So hi, what's up? It's your boy Sports Wizard, and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing Djokovic versus Adelia in Olympic first round. So let's get right into it. And actually, before we get into it, I'm finally a tennis prediction after a long time. Like finally, it's been like maybe a week since the Wimbledon final. Um, but yeah, and it's Olympics time, baby. Like it's Olympics time finally. Like um, obviously this only happens once every four years so yeah what better way to start it off other than a Djokovic match so let's get into the prediction so yeah I just can't like contain myself from the Olympics like excitement I'll see like it begins on the 24th which at least at the time of recording is in two days but anyway my prediction Djokovic in straight at score and 6362 mode easy so he'll, he'll cruise through it like like we all know he's gonna cruise through it and yeah, let's get into the analyzation. So Djokovic has 20 Grand Slams, 84 titles. He won out of the Masters 1000 at least twice. He also won out of the Grand Slams at least twice. He's currently number one in the world. He's an aggressive base runner. He has good grand strokes. He has the best back runner on tour, arguably. Uh, he has a good serve that's flat. He's a good returner. He's good in the crucial moments. He's also good at coming back and playing under pressure. He's a good mover and he can do both offense and defense. Djokovic doesn't have a good smash and his temper can cause problems and he maybe takes the ball a little too early. But other than that, he doesn't even have any weaknesses. Djokovic won one more than five times, he also opened three times. Austrian opened nine times and French opened two times. He won the Olympic bronze medal and he won five ATP finals. So yeah, in 2008, he won the Olympic bronze medal. Now coming into DDN, he went to the Roland Girls, he also opened second round. Austrian opened and won more than first round. He has zero titles, he's an aggressive base runner, he's good at rallies, he's a good mover, and he went to the Olympics first round, which is right now. So yeah. In the first set, Djokovic will like go aggressive, like he's gonna hit winners, he's gonna hit aces, he's gonna make Delian move around. But Delian is a good mover, but like he's still gonna struggle with Djokovic. Um, yeah, so he's gonna do all that. Well, Delian, I mean, he's gonna he's gonna keep trying to rally with Djokovic, but Djokovic is just gonna cut it short with the winner, or he's gonna keep rallying with Delian until Delian hit it hits it out and the second side i think that's where Delian just gets tired from moving around and you know like, trying to find a way to beat djokovic and djokovic like he doesn't even need to go aggressive at that point you know what i mean like he can just keep rallying with Delian. Delian will just break down and if he wants to we can hit a couple of winners here and there and eventually djokovic will come out on top so yeah guys this is my prediction please make sure to like subscribe and turn on the notifications and also, I believe today, soon I will be doing videos, like, more videos, like, obviously, Djokovic versus Delian is one. I'll also be doing Rublev Nishikori, Zvera versus Liu Hai Sun, uh, Fuchovic versus Herkax, Sirspa Skol, Scarber Murray versus Ojalisi, Member of Bublik, Bardi versus Sori Base Tormo, Diaz versus Krajcikova, Sablanka versus Lynette, Pliskova versus Korne, Svirilina versus Sijman, Sviatek versus Bartel, and Osa versus Zeg. But all of these videos are not going to be today. I'm going to split them out today and tomorrow. So yeah, just look forward to those videos. And yeah, guys, like, subscribe, and turn on the notifications. And I'll see you next time. Peace.